Hey flower folks, welcome to Sheer Inspirations. In today's video, we are going to be taking a look at the sample seed shop. I'm going to be reviewing my purchase of cut flower seeds from this store. The um, packaging was in this bubble wrap and those are all the seeds that I got. I wanted to start out by saying that this is not a sponsored video. I did not get the seeds for free. Um, this is purchased from my own money and I am just doing this review to share my experience um, with the with the person that I purchased the seeds from and so on and so forth with just the, the, the uh, experience with the business in general. This is a small business based out of New York. The person who runs it, her name is Remy, R-E-M-Y, I believe I'm pronouncing, I'm hoping and believing that I'm pronouncing this correctly. The business has been in um, place since 2009. It is a small business. Um, she has a website and a Facebook page that I have been following for the last two years or so. Um, I personally uh, have not made a purchase up until recently because I am a frugal gardener and I believe that um, spending a whole ton of money on seeds is not really um, a frugal way. I spent a total of $20 on all of the seeds that you see here. This is the receipt, as you can see. There's a bonus seed that she included. Um, the total amount came out to be $19.12 for her, and then PayPal took some fees. Um, the seed packets, of course, varied anywhere from a dollar to one dollar seventy-five cents. Um, the total amount of seeds packets that I purchased was 10 and she gave me one extra as a bonus. The, if you purchase 10 packets, you would then pay $5.50 for shipping. If you pay 11 to 20, it's $6.50 and so on and so forth. Um, understanding that the prices at the post office go up every year, uh, she has to adjust her prices accordingly. Um, the website uh, that the that, I, that you purchase all of this from, I have to say, it's a little bit hard to maneuver. Um, I was overwhelmed with it for quite some time because when you go on it, you really don't know what to do except clicking on each tab. So one day, I just sat down and took out about one hour and 30 minutes out of my day and just sat down and clicked on each tab and thoroughly studied the website as to what exactly it had to offer. My conclusion was that it is um, easy once you know what you're looking for, but you can't just search up in the search bar and have it come up. It will lead you to the page that you will find it, but you'll still have to scroll back and forth, up and down to exactly see what you're looking for. I went through the entire website. I actually had a list prior to what I was looking for and I um, went in and marked, added all the items into the cart. The cart is PayPal's cart, so it's attached to PayPal. She does mention on her website that some people have problems with that. I didn't experience any problems with it. It was quite simple. Um, the, the, the packaging was via tracking number in um, first class mail. So uh, the website states that it will get here in one week. I thought that it would be processed in one week and not get here in one week, except I uh, put in my order Sunday night and it was here on Saturday. So I was pretty impressed by that. The um, variety of flowers that you get, once you thoroughly <laughs> once you thoroughly go through the website and, and see exactly what she has to offer, biennials, perennials, annuals, and make a list, she has a huge variety of cut flower seeds. So I personally wanted to try out some of these things that you see there and I have not been able to locate them either at the 99 cent store or the Dollar Tree or my free seed swaps that I do via Facebook groups that I'm a part of. So I made the decision that I'm going to go ahead and um, go with her because it was a couple other companies that I wanted to um, go by, but I like supporting small businesses whenever I can since I'm one of them myself. I 
try and support as, as long as they're not charging up the ante for their prices. Each packet was about $1.75, $2. The seeds are plenty in there, even though she says that there's only 100 seeds in there, there there's still plenty. Um, but something to note here is that she does say this on her website too, and I want to mention, it's just coin envelopes, simple coin envelopes. There's no instructions on the seed packet as to how to grow it or anything like that. Um, she says, you know, if you have any trouble to locate how to grow something, please reach out to me. I am um, a horticulturist and a botanist myself, so I, you know, have a good idea as to how to grow these things. But for somebody who is a new gardener, you do have to do your research as to what would grow where and so on and so forth. Um, I personally have, um, ex you know, did all of my research as to what I can grow in my greenhouses versus what I can grow in the fall versus what I can grow in the summer and so on and so forth. The um, shipping, as I said earlier, the package came to me from New York to California and it got here. It was shipped to me on Wednesday and got here on Saturday. So that was really good. Um, she says that the website, the um, ordering time and the processing time is a little bit longer from January to March. I ordered in November and she also says from November to January it's still busy but it's, um, it's process. The best thing I liked about it is the fact that it processes every all year long. There's no um, deadline as to if you pass this date then you're too far and or the catalog doesn't release until this time. There's no catalogs, there's no fancy um, bells and whistles with this website. You go on there, you order and you get your stuff but you do have to know what you're doing. Um, if you don't then go ahead and study the website like I did and search up the seeds. Um, now I wanted to share exactly what all I have purchased. I'm going to go ahead and focus on all of the seeds that I have here. So I have Dame's Rocket. This is a um, somewhat of an invasive plant, a lot of people say, but I wanted to grow it. I'm, I'm in the desert, Southern California high desert. It is not listed as an invasive plant here. I'm going to go ahead and give it a go. Um, this is a, a native plant of here, a California native plant. So I'm very excited to get seeds of this. This is a biannual cup and saucer um, plant. This is something that I've been searching seeds for for a very long time. Finally found them, so excited. This is a um, fall sown corn cockle. Uh, they only come in three colors, white, pink, and purple, I believe. I have a purple one here. Um, this is for next season, Cathedral Bells. These are um, vining plants. Once my sweet peas are done, that's what I will be growing. These are Bonari Giant Zinnias. I have never done, grown Bonari Giants. I've always grown California Giants. So um, this is a Painted Tongue. Right here is the bonus sun, uh, bonus plant seeds, rainbow loveless. This is a sweet William sweet William variety. Then I have status like this carmine rose color, and this one is uh, very similar to um, hydrangeas, and they're small blue bushy type of plants. I'm planning on putting them in my greenhouse and growing them um, through the winter in the greenhouse and seeing how that goes. I will be making videos of all of the uh, ones on top when I direct sow these in my garden and share with you guys how my experience is. I can't comment on how the germination rate is because obviously I haven't grown out of these. This is my first time. I will be sure that uh, once they flower for me next spring that I will share those flowers and experiences with you. I have not heard anything but good uh, reviews from this website. I did the um, Dave's Garden. I did her um, Facebook reviews. I checked all those. So they, nobody's had complaints about germination rate. So I'm very excited to go ahead and give them a shot. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys, and give this company a try. Um, minimal, you can do a minimal order. It will still cost you $5.50 to ship. If you do 10, seat, 10 packets, uh, it would still be the same. So I recommend doing that instead of getting one seat packet for $5.50. 
Anyway, I will go ahead and leave a link to where to purchase and I will see you in the next one. Bye.